Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Shruti. And I'm Dre. And together we are Beauty and the Beauty. So today we're watching Free Ren. So today we're jumping back into Free Ren for season one, episode three Killing Magic. Let's get right into it. Let's do it. Free Ren! 27 years after the death of He Mail the Hero in the Trade City of Worm, located in the Central Lands. Oh, look how tall she is. Oh my god, her voice is different. Some dragon horn. <laughs> there you go. That's the face <laughs> You were just talking about horns. この薬は服だけとかするんだよ。あ、ウォー。素敵なさい。魔法師の方、座学も大事だからね。ロキンだって無駄遣いできないのに。しっかり見張っておかないと。Can they just create more funds? So she's interested in fashion. Maybe she knows you're there. すごい悩んでる。She's picking out a gift for you. How did Arthur get here? <laughs><笑><笑> Planning a birthday party. Mm, imagine. True, a gift, a cake. It's a hookah lounge. This guy's the uh, fucking Legion of Doom shoulder pads. You might be dessert. Jesus Christ. Coming in in your short white skirt. この町には美味しいスイーツが山のようにあるぜ。聞ける場所なんだ。あれ、デザーズアコールワードフォーシンだ。スイーツは俺たち冒険者の活力だからな。あばよ。And you have none of the daily essentials. That's right. That's a beautiful view. Yeah, I'm right. Yeah. わあ、エソクリなんてあったんだ。ビビビビセクレス。メルクアプリンですよね。今日の気分はメルクアプリンだろう。なんでわかるの?なんとなくわかるさ。私はみんなのこと何もわからない。ちなみに僕の好物はル
ところでフリーレン様この旅って何か目的はあるんですかできる限りはヒンメルたちとの冒険の痕跡をたどっていきたいかな風化する前にねそれはフリーレン様にとって、はい、そうこうしかしついに背も抜かされちゃったか、うん、もう16ですからねお姉さんです<笑>わお、わしゃべりすぎるんじゃ。ああ、わしゃべりすぎるんじゃ。ああ、わしゃべりすぎるんじゃ。広範囲の展開を続けたら数十秒で魔力切れになるよ着弾の瞬間に部分的に展開させるのが正解というわけですねそうだねフェルン渡した魔法師の本読んでないでしょ魔法は実践だけが大事なわけじゃないんだよ<笑>そうだなちょっと聞きたいことがあるんだけどエルフだ白髪もしやフリーレン様ですかなクバール腐敗の剣狼クバール80年前にこの地で悪逆の限りを尽くしたマドリスそれを勇者ヒンメル様ご一行が封印したのです<笑> 30年ほど前まで毎年のように村に訪れておりました。封印の様子を確認するためだそうで。相変わらずのお人よしだ。フリーレン様のこともお話ししておりました。冷たいよね。冷たいね。<笑>でも、村を見捨てるほど白状ではない。わお、Look at that. Holy Jesus. これが Massive. Whoa. It's like she was teaching you all them defensive tricks. Free Ren Samoa, Kubaru, or Fuin Stano de Sione. So Stanonima, Nanika, you go to Nodesco. Catena Cata Kubaru, a Maogu, no Naka, the Kushino, the Hotskaida Zorto Rak Jinru, the Bogia Maho, or Mochiro. 装備の魔法耐性さえも貫通し人体を直接破壊する魔法だ魔法使いに至っては7割がゾルトラークの殺さないと言われてわあ、これそんなの強すぎるじゃないですかパスタンスだからこそその強さがあだになったわあ、どういうことですか本当に魔法師読んでいないんだねやっぱり読み聞かせようか。今から読みます。いや、いいよ。ああ。何年たった。I think he was. 八十年。たった八十年。Mayor。私たちにとってはね。フェルン、前方に防御魔法。So、oh, shit. That's, that's the piercing one. Zoltorak of Segutua. Oh, boy. Zoe. Cold or a bog your jutuski jano. Freedom, some. Arega Zoltorak. Yatsuga Kai Hatsista, you are you. Hito Korosma Hodayo. お前の魔法は強すぎたんだ。Was past tense again. お前が封印されてから、大陸中の魔法使いが。Oh, okay. 研究、解析し、ゾルトラークは人類の魔法体系に組み込まれ、wow. 新しい防御術式による強力な防御魔法が開発された。And 80 years work on it. 
Your offense led to improving our defense. Pretty much. Now it's just ordinary, bruh. <laughs> Let me think about this. Wow, she's doing it, babe. The singular ones. Ooh. Oh. oh, shit. Oh, shit. Jeez, oh! Yo, is it looking... It created a portal or something? That's crazy. They couldn't defeat you, put you in the frost, learned your magic, took you out the frost, and killed you with your own shit. Bruh. Disrespect is old track. <laughs> A giant statue you guys had. You remember seeing him 80 years ago? It's Luffy! <laughs> yeah, right? Ah! <laughs> oh, 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 I'll show you. People are free. Wow. That's he knew you wouldn't visit, but he knew you wouldn't let them suffer. She's seeing a different side of Freeran. Fern and Freeran. Wow. Wow. Man, that was, that was a great cool. episode, man. Yeah. I, what was crazy it was like you she um Fern was saying that you always let me purchase all the shit, but it's because she was saving up secretly so she could give her a gift. And the thing is, what's interesting about the fact that she was saving up secretly to produce a gift for a human that would have an emotional reaction to this to this day that is like any other for Freerun, right? It's like it's one of the 80 days I've lived in the past. It's one of the one of the days I've lived in the past 80, 80 100, years. 200 yeah. years, you know what I'm saying? But knowing being able to interpret the human condition in the way that she was able to or or developing her 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 view of the human condition she's like okay to make this day even more special i'm gonna do this human custom i'm gonna save my money i'm going to buy a gift and i always notice that they exchange the gifts over desserts you know what i'm saying so let me buy something sweet so i can then give her her cherry on top of it you know and like what was crazy was that fern was telling her she didn't understand human emotions not knowing that she was setting her up to display her most human side you know like Man. That was dope. That was dope. Because the thing is, like, free run is so interesting because she can do something so caring, so loving, so tender as giving her... Wow. Wow. So that's where we're visiting. That's intense. Yeah, so she can do something as kind, something as tender, something as caring as... Saving up her money, not to not to buy herself something selfishly, but to provide somebody else with a sense of joy through this gift that you give them and this dessert that you fill them up with. And it was crazy because Fern was telling her she doesn't even understand the human emotion. She does. She didn't. She didn't even understand that. Mm -hmm. So the fact that Freerin could even conjure up that thought process was crazy. And what I was going to say was she can say she can do something that kind. As calmly and as plainly, like she didn't say, "Hey, surprise!" You know, she's like, "Here's a gift for you," and would you like some dessert? And she used that same stone face to be like, 
I'm going to unfreeze this giant and then I'm going to kill him. Like everything is so matter of fact, but the things that matter to her now are becoming even more human than she's ever been. Wow. Incredible. She's no longer the cold hearted girl that these guys thought she was, you know? Man, and I love that they keep going back to the back because, like, you can tell, like, though, like, she does, she maybe at the time she didn't realize it, but you can tell just the way the music they overlaid, like, those were the most important times in her life when she was with her, when she had, when the band was all together. You know what I'm saying? That's why all their steps are, she's trying to retrace, you know, like, what did she miss out on that particular moment that that adventure that they had together? She's like, let me find the emotion that I was supposed to feel. Man, I mean, it's, it's incredible to see. And like, I love those those things because there's no, they, like their journey, like it's, it's a great title for the story because the journey that she had with that team has ended. ended yeah. And now it's beyond journey's end. You know what I'm saying? So now it's just, and the thing is, even though it's beyond Journey's end, like you said, she's just retracing her steps in some cases. In this case, she needed to because the, the demon that they put away was about to come and tear up the village. However, like she's retracing those steps because like she didn't even realize how impactful or how deep or how meaningful, meaningful those steps yeah. were when she was taking them in the first place. Right. Wow. Another impressive episode of Freeman, and we can't wait to get on to our next one. So thank you all for joining us for the latest episode of be sure to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to like the video. Let us know what you thought about the episode down in our comments and be sure to go over to our Patreon to check out our full length uncut reaction or stop by simply to support our channel. I'm Shruti. And I'm Dre for Beauty and the Bear. We're signing off until the next one. Peace.